Geobyte. Welcome to Geobyte. Hi kids. Good morning. How are you all? Had your breakfast? Today, let us know about patterns. Now, let us get into the topic. Extend the sequence. Hey kids, see here. There are two lines, circle, two lines, circle and two lines. After two lines, which shape comes? Circle or two lines? Let us see. After two lines, we have a circle. After two lines, we have a circle. So, we get a circle after two lines. And again, after circle, we have two lines. After circle, we have two lines. So, after circle, we get two lines. See here. V, upside down V. V, upside down V. Which V comes after upside down V? V or upside down V? Let us see. After upside down V, we have a V. So, after upside down V, we get a V. Again, after V. See, after V, we have an upside down V. After V, an upside down V. So, after V, we get an upside down V. Again, after upside down V, we have a V. After upside down V, we have a V. So, after upside down V, we get a V. Two circles, rectangle. Two circles, after two circles, which shape comes? Rectangle or two circles? Let us see. After two circles, we have a rectangle. So, after two circles, we get a rectangle. Again, after rectangle, we have two circles. Let us draw two circles. Now, see here. T, upside down T. T, upside down T. Which T comes after upside down T? Let us see. After upside down T, we have a T. So, we get a T after upside down T. Again, after T, we have an upside down T. After T, an upside down T. So, here also, after T, we get an upside down T. Again, after upside down T, we get... After upside down T, we get a T. So, let us draw T. Hey kids, there is a small activity for you. Try to practice the topic, extend the sequence at your home. Now, we have completely understood the topic, extend the sequence. Now, let us get into the topic, what comes next? Hey kids, see here, there is a flower, leaf, flower, leaf. What comes next? Flower or leaf? Let us see. Kids, after leaf, we got a flower. So, after leaf, we will get a flower. Now, see here. 
there are few expressions happy expression sad expression happy expression sad expression what comes next happy expression or sad expression let us see after sad expression we have a happy expression so after sad expression we will get a happy expression now see here there are few semicircles semicircle upside down semicircle semicircle upside down semicircle what comes next upside down semicircle or semicircle let us see after upside down semicircle we got a semicircle so after upside down semicircle we will get a semicircle hey kids there is a small activity for you try to practice the topic what comes next at your home now we have completely understood the topic what comes next now let us get into the topic fill in the blanks hey kids see here we have few shapes in a sequence let us see a circle triangle circle triangle dash triangle and circle what comes in the blank yes correct answer it is circle now see here we have a leaf in this leaf two more leaves are added and in this leaf two more leaves are added what comes in the blank yes more two leaves will be added let us draw now let us see this sequence a house coming to the next one one line is removed coming to the next one two lines are removed coming to the next one three lines are removed what comes in the blank yes there will be only one line four lines are removed hey kids there is a small activity for you try to practice the topic fill in the blanks at your home now we have completely understood the topic fill in the blanks now let us get into the topic study the pattern and fill in the missing numbers hey kids see here we have few balloons in a sequence now let us see the numbers inside the balloons 1 leaf 2 3 leaf 4 5 leaf 6 what comes after 6 7 7 let us write 7 7 leaf 8 9 so our number is correct now let us go to the flags see leaf 1 2 leaf 3 4 leaf 5 6 leaf 7 what comes there after 7 8 let us write Eight. Now see this caterpillar. 
there are few numbers inside 10 11 12 13 after 13 14 let us write 14 15 16 our sequence is correct hey kids there is a small activity for you try to practice the topic study the pattern and fill in the missing numbers at your home now we have completely understood the topic study the pattern and fill in the missing numbers now let us get into the topic complete the pattern hey kids see here we have few boxes there are some objects in the boxes let us go one by one first let us go with this sequence one there is one star in this box one two there are two stars in this box one two three there are three stars in this box how many stars will come in this box one two three and four let us draw four stars Now let us go with this sequence. One, two, two triangles. One, two, three, three triangles. One, two, three, four, four triangles. Now how many triangles will come in this box? Two, three, four and Five. Let us draw five triangles. Now let us go with this sequence. One, two, three, four. Four wheels in this box. One, two, three, four. Five. Five wheels in this box. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six wheels in this box. How many wheels will come in this box? Four, five, six and seven. Let us draw seven wheels. Kids, there is a small activity for you. Try to practice the topic, complete the pattern at your home. Now, we have completely understood the topic, complete the pattern. Now, let us get into the topic, complete the pattern using numbers. Hey kids, see here, we have few objects. Let us go one by one. Now, let us go with leaves. See here, leaf one, two in the leaf, leaf three, four in the leaf, leaf five, six in the leaf, leaf seven, eight in the leaf, leaf nine, ten in the leaf. If we leave eleven, which number comes in that leaf? 12. Let us write 12 in the leaf. Now, coming to this buckets. 
25 in the bucket, 26 in the bucket, 27 in the bucket. After 27, which numbers will come in these two buckets? 28 and 29. Let us write those two numbers. Now, let us go with these tomatoes. 41 in the tomato, 42 in the tomato, 43 in the tomato. After 43, which number comes in this tomato? 44. Let us write 44 in the tomato. We got 44. 44 in the tomato, 45 in the tomato, after 45 and before 47, which number comes in the tomato? Yes, 46 comes in the tomato. Let us write. Forty six in the tomato, forty seven in the tomato. Which number comes in this tomato? Forty eight. Let us write forty eight in this tomato. Hey kids, there is a small activity for you. Try to practice the topic. Complete the pattern using numbers at your home. Now we have completely understood the topic, complete the pattern using numbers. Thank you for watching. Please do like, share, comment and subscribe to Geobyte. Geobyte.